Hello beautiful people, it's your girl K-E-R-R-Y Carrie and welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, I focus on fashion, lifestyle, travel and beauty. So if that is something you are interested in, I would love to have you come and join the crew. So don't hesitate, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and notification bell so you never miss a post. Welcome back to my oldies, but goodies, you already know, the love is real. I know, I know, oh no, nobody beat me. I've been away for a while. I couldn't tell the last time I did a clothing haul, but I'm back, okay? I'm back, and I'm better. Um, it's been a few weeks of traveling, the back and forth then coming back to deal with uh hurricanes tornadoes it, it got sick in the process it was a lot but i'm doing so much better thank god the hurricane or the tornadoes did not affect us and i'm still keeping those who were affected uh in my prayers so if you're watching this video and you were affected by the um past hurricanes i just want to say i'm keeping you guys in my prayers and i hope that um you did not experience much damage but if you did just know that you have life and we can always rebuild and again i'm keeping you in my prayers this all is gonna be a long one it's a collective all <laughs> and i have quite a few things so when i say grab your water grab your coffee grab your tea grab your drink of choice also grab a seat have a seat sit down because this is gonna be a long one let's get into the show Alrighty, welcome back i hope you are seated and settled i should be si um sitting as well <laughs> but i think i'll get through this quicker standing so let's go ahead and get into all the things because i've been doing the most and if i did not mention before october is my birth month so everything every purchase that i make in october i'm like it's for my birthday it's a birthday gift <laughs> please forgive me um on my lips i have a combo on my lip that i am loving right now i lined my lip with mac chestnut i always do but i have been using uh charlotte tillsbury uh cat walking so this is how it looks so it's like a nude with a peachy undertone and i absolutely love it it is matte matte it goes on so smooth real hydrating so it will not dry your lips out that i love absolutely love that because my lip then will get choppy and then for uh earrings these are from victoria emerson i will link them for you guys i got these as a gift when i went to ltk con and i absolutely love them they've been my favorite um ever since i've been back and the nails burgundy is the color of the season and i was like i couldn't tell the last time i wore uh nail polish so it looks like it's coming up like purple on um screen but it's actually uh like a rich deep uh burgundy and i absolutely love it i think that i'm gonna get it back when i go back to get my nails done i'm gonna repaint them in this uh color because i i love it okay the outfit the outfit something simple because i'm gonna be here for a while chatting so <laughs> Uh, the top is from Zara. It's an uh, oversized uh, t-shirt and I love it because you know the western trend is the western trend is still live and 
doing its thing and so when i saw this it had the burgundy writing with the orsis i was like okay i like it i like it and so i paired it with this uh snake print uh pants also from zara i'm gonna pop up the full look on the side so pants also from zara absolutely love it i think it is still available so i'm definitely gonna link it in the description box for you and then for shoes i recently purchased these while i was in new york the other day and i absolutely love them these are some platform uh booties from michael kors but i got them at uh, macy's because they were having like a 30 percent off sale and i was like oh i love these they also come in black but i have nothing like this in my closet so i was like i want this and so absolutely love like i said they're real comfy i did go up a half size so I got a nine and a half just because when I wear boots I always wear them with uh, socks so just a FYI um, to me they're not heavy I'm not sure um, uh, to me they're not heavy let me just say that they are perfectly fine for me I don't know if someone else would say that um, they're heavy but I also love the brass um, detailing on it absolutely love that so i paired that with this look and then for a bag i went in with uh this burgundy bag just to play off of the burgundy in the t-shirt and to mix the browns with the burgundy because like this is like this color is going with everything at the moment okay like look at my nails against this bag everything and then to finish the look because it is fall and i'm gonna dress for the season like me not care where me live me go dead in the name of fashion over here i dress for the season if it's summer fall uh maybe not winter because that's a little bit drastic <laughs> spring but i'm dressing for the season okay i popped on this uh, brown cropped at uh, jacket it's old from the pixie market let me grab it real quick so this is it right here i bought this last year so if you've been here for a while you would have seen this last year i'm not sure if you remember it it's from the pixie market absolutely love that it's cropped it is structured shoulders padded i will check to see if it is still available and link it for you just to bring out the brown and to jazz it up for a nice like chill casual fall look so let me know what are your thoughts in the comments on the look that i'm wearing today now that i'm done with the look that i'm wearing today let's talk about accessories real quick and i'm gonna run through them because some of them i will be using them to style the clothing items in this video so quickly slingbacks these are great for fall your toes are covered you can wear them with pants skirt shorts you name it i picked this one up during the Macy's uh, shoe sale again this is from Michael Kors love the uh, like deep red next to burgundy color and it is in this uh, croc material absolutely love it it does have a little eel so I love that for me I also love the buckle gold detail on it so so in love if you follow me on instagram you would have already seen um this it also comes in black it comes in gold and i think it also comes in silver so if you like it grab it this one it is a inspired it's a dupe of the ghani uh slingback 
uh, flats. So this one is from Walmart. It's from the brand Scoop. The soles are padded. I love, love, love the silver detailing. It also comes in red. And when I say this is comfy, I mean it is very comfortable. I took these to New York with me, walked around in them. So comfy. I would buy these again and again because I love them that much. Next up, another uh, another uh, booties. These are from H&M. Absolutely love the Western style. Love that it's not super high and the eel is chunky. I picked this up, I think, in a size uh, 10. Because, again, I normally size up. They didn't have any half sizes. So I opted to go for a 10. Fits perfect. This also comes in black. This is like the like dark chocolate uh, brown. Absolutely love, love this. You're going to see this a lot during the fall time. And then uh, sneakers. I have two of those. So first up, I have another Samba. Yeah. I bought another Samba. You guys would have seen this in the LTK Con vlog. I love Sambas. They're very comfortable to me. I opted to go with a black pair this go around. I'm looking for a navy pair and a burgundy pair. So those two are next on my list. For me, I buy my regular size. So I buy a size 9. And if it's perfect uh, for me, if you are probably in between like sizes, I would say size down. I can definitely size down, but I prefer not to because I love to walk. I do a lot of walking and I always wear them with socks anyways. Uh, next up is another sneaker. This is from uh, Kirk Geiger. Uh, I am doing a campaign with them on Instagram and they sent me this pair of sneakers from their new collection which is the South South Bank collection. I love that it's chunky. I love the gold and uh, metallic uh, colors. This is so perfect for fall. Like, look at the laces, how wide they are. And it also comes with the tag. So it's called the South Bank Tag Sneakers. And if you don't like the gold um, combination color, you can definitely do it in other colorways because they do have other colorways. So I will definitely link this in the description box for you. I went with my regular size, which is a size 9. And they fit perfect for me. Next up bags and since we just talked about Kurt Geiger's South Bank collection they also sent me over two bags from the South Bank uh, collection absolutely love again in the gold combination color to match the sneakers and I opted to go with the South Bank tote so this is the largest tote in the collection. At the bottom it says um, Kurt. And on the this tote I, I have the South Bank uh, key ring on there. So this is a, a key ring. You can drop like coins and so on in there. And you can also interchange it um, on bags. It comes with a long strap for crossbody or on the shoulder and then it has top handle it holds it can hold quite a bit because it is really like big and deep it does have um like three different pockets on the inside this this one right here uh this one right here with a zipper and then this one right here that is like a card holder. So this is a, the South Bank tote. And then 
also the South Bank tote, but this is the uh, extra small. So this is the extra small and they have a smaller version to this, which is the micro or the mini. And again, this is like a nice size. It does come with the Kurt Geiger tag. Absolutely love that. And again, this, uh, you, you guys know I love tiny bags, but this one is not so tiny. Like the one below this would be <laughs> my ideal tiny bag because this can definitely hold uh, quite a bit. It does have um, a pocket on the inside as well and also comes with the crossbody uh, strap. So that's it for the Kurt Geiger South Bank collection. I'll definitely link them in the description box for you. So if you are interested in getting them, please do. They are great. I'm going to be carrying these around a lot because they old they old some things okay another bag the last bag is this brown suede oboe bag from gap the moment i saw this bag i was like i want it i also heard that it came in chocolate brown but it's currently sold out but this right here absolutely love it like look at this it is big and it can hold a lot big bags are trending right now like you guys know how much i love me a tiny bag but big bags are trending and i'm keeping up okay <laughs> i'm keeping up i will not be caught I will not be caught off guard. I'm keeping up. So this, I love. Oh, I could definitely wear this bag with this look as well. Oh, I love. It does have a uh, pocket on the inside right there. So, yeah. Absolutely love. Again, this is from Gap. And it was for under a hundred dollars and they've been having some good sales lately so if you can get your hand on it please do I think that is it for accessories at the moment I have a few things coming in because I've been laying in bed at nights ordering okay oh and I also cleaned up my closet I did a closet purge so my closet is practically empty right now when i say i purge i've never put out so many things ever <laughs> i have empty a lot of empty spaces so you know what time it is okay y'all are gonna be getting these these alls so let's go shopping anywho outfit number one another piece from gap is this uh stripe blue and white stripe barrel sleeve you guys know how much i love me a good barrel jeans but guess what gap says we don't only have barrel jeans and pants we can do barrel sleeves as well like look look at the sleeve my only wish would be that this would have been a little bit thicker but when you put it on it stays in place so I guess it's just me having like super high expectations but nonetheless I got this in a size medium it fits perfect it also comes in a red and white um, stripe as well I went ahead and paired it with this dark wash cargo style jeans pants and I'm obsessed. Cargo pants and barrel pants are my faves, okay? But a denim, anything, I love. But cargos, barrel jeans, give them to me. This cargo pants is from uh, Lioness. 
I'm not sure if it is still available because I actually bought this to take to fashion week with me it went but I didn't get a chance to wear it and so when I got this top in I was like oh I love them together you're seeing it on the cutaway I absolutely love this uh, combination I got the pants in a size large FYI so if I find a link for it just know that I got it in a size large I always size up especially to get length because I mean I need to look like me take my measurement in a water okay so most times I size up for length and then if I have to get it altered then I'll do that paired it with my mesh Zara pumps and the suede bag from Gap that I just showed you and I love this look this is the simple easy breezy fall look that I'm actually loving and I cannot wait to wear it out I already wore the shirt out but not with this so I'm excited to wear both together so let me know what are your th next up is this jumpsuit from the Frankie shop I've always wanted this uh, jumpsuit ever since I saw um, styled by Kemi and I mean like it's been maybe about two years that I saw her with uh, this jumpsuit and I was like I'm not ready to splurge I love a good jumpsuit but I wasn't ready to splurge when I saw it this time around I was like oh I want it and I want it in this olive green color it also comes in cream and I want the cream as well but for right now we're gonna stick with her love 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 the big cargo pockets on the front and also on the side I got this in a size small I think which was not a good idea because it fits close to me I wanted it to be a little bit more relaxed but I'm not mad at it I'm not mad at it because it runs big so I read the reviews and it ra um, runs big and that's why I went for a small it's I can breathe in it I can move easily I've just been stepping away I spoke to you guys the other day about this like stepping away from clothes that are like super clingy and tight I, 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 I'm too old for that okay like <laughs> relax me a little bit let me relax a little bit so but again I'm not mad at it I opted to style this with uh, burgundy because I love olive green and burgundy during the fall time they, they look good together I know it's not some people cup of tea cup of tea but it's my shutter room okay mm -hmm. me like it you can pair it with black, brown, uh, gold. I, 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 I like it with burgundy. Maybe next time I'll do it with black. But I love it. I also took pictures of this while I was in New York. I'll pop up pictures on the screen to show you. And you are seeing it on the cutaway. I paired it with the fur, Fox Fur Sandals from Walmart and that uh, burgundy bag from Asus absolutely love okay absolutely love cannot get enough cannot get enough something else I picked up from the Frankie shop that I've always wanted but it was it tends to sell out real quick uh, share is a fall trend this season and it's it's I think it's been around for a hot minute but it is still alive and well and I don't think that it's gonna go away anytime soon so it's safe to say I'm good with the pieces that I've accumulated in this trend so I picked up this brown because I'm absolutely loving brown burgundy and black right now like i know i'm a color gal but right now these colors are just my thing right now so 
I'm going to get enough wear out of them until the spring and summertime comes around when we start brightening up the place again. But for right now, I'm still going to dibble and dabble in the color because we're going to wear it whenever. But for right now, I'm absolutely loving brown and black and burgundy. So, you know, please make me be great. This long sleeve shirt top, I got it in a size uh, extra small, small. I could have done a medium large. It runs big. It fits oversized. So, I'm not mad at it. Love, love, love the sharp um, collar detail. Shoulders are padded like heavily padded, giving me running back quarterback vibes. But that, you already know, that's the vibe I'm on. Give me some structure, okay? So, I opted to pair it with, I'm doing full brown, like mocha, chocolate, okay? So, I'm popping on this quoted uh, jeans pants from H&M. Love, love, my, on, my only grouse. I should have gotten it in a size 10 so I'm gonna return it to get it in a size 10 I got it in a size 8 it fits perfect but I don't want it to fit um, to be as fitted as it is so I'm pairing both together <clears throat> and then my brown Western boots from H&M my brown bag from the vault label because we're doing a full-on brown monochromatic look look and then I popped on my act from Rusalyn Beginsky I know I'm butchering it so forgive me you're seeing the look on the cutaway I cannot wait to wear this out like I love this I'm going to be dressing up every single day for fall. Like every day you see me, I'm dressed. Car Where are you going? Uh, nowhere. My husband literally asked me yesterday, Wh "Where are you going?" Um this this I'm not going anywhere, but I am the occasion, okay? So I'm I'm going to always dress the part. <laughs> so that's it for this look let me know if you like it next outfit because <laughs> we have looks okay wally for them <laughs> so i picked up this uh top from uh zara i got it in a size medium so it's this white top it looks basic but if you notice it has like this mock corset vibe going on um, the camera is not picking it up, but you can see it under there. And then it does have these um, lock for you to like lock in the back and cinch your waist. Love, love, love the cap sleeve. So I went ahead and paired it with this uh, jeans pants. I'm not sure if you guys remember this jeans pants. I bought it from Fashion Nova uh, sometime in, I think, March, April. And I was complaining, oh, it didn't fit. And you, you guys were like, you like it. I should get the waist tailored. Well, I didn't get the waist tailored. But what I did do is gain more than a few pounds. And so the girl... <laughs> it's fitting in the jeans okay <laughs> it's I, I love the fit right now the fit is immaculate it makes me not want to lose the few pounds that I put on but I have to absolutely love the cuff and the brown the brown stitch like you can see the brown stitch I got this in a size 9 and I think they run big, but I'm happy that I got it in a size nine because it's just everything. The fit is just everything. You're seeing it on the cutaway. So let's go ahead and jazz it up for fall because that's the season, okay? You can take something simple, add your accessories and jazz it up and just take it up a notch. That's what fall is about. When fall is around, 
the fashion girls come out to play okay so I was in H&M this weekend and I picked up this suede jacket <laughs> baby baby she chef's kisses chef's kiss okay I got it in a size medium I love that it's long enough to cover my butt. I also love that it's not heavy because, again, I live in Florida. I want to look the part, but me no want bun up. So, I love that it's light. It is a suede, which is trending right now. Brown is trending right now. And I love this, like, camel color uh, brown love 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 the big utility pockets oh baby so you're seeing it on the cutaway we we love i love this okay so popped on my zara mesh pumps just for a nice peek of the brown and girl <laughs> A vibe a vibe okay absolutely love this let me know what are your thoughts you guys know how I feel about a denim on denim look and the no no all is complete without a denim on denim look like the Canadian tuxedo has to enter the chat so again I was in H&M. At this point, this all should have been, should have just been an H&M all. <laughs> but I was in H&M, minding my business. My sister walks in. She's like, sister, you need this look. And she always come through. She's always right. I'm going to give that to her. Look at this. So it's a denim jacket. And it has these like a uh, stone detail on there in black love the blue and black wash combination so the black wash is on the collar absolutely love like it has like a poofy sleeve and this smells good because I already wore it <laughs> come thirsty and then I picked up the matching skirt to go with it. So, like, look at this. I'm definitely going to be wearing this again. Probably during, like, Art Basel. Because this is definitely artsy. But on the fun side as well. Like, I love, love the stone um, detail. Like, far away it gives, like, this uh, glistening glitter effect. Absolutely love it. The skirt shot is shot is shot bad. <laughs> My husband was like, where's the rest of your skirt? I was like, me never pay feet, so them not give me it. <laughs> this is so good. So... I opted to bring out the black in this, so I paired it with my black western uh, knee-eye boots. Those are old from Forever 21. I had them since last year, but the western theme is still going, so I'm going to be linking similars for you. My little black bag from the vault label, and that completed the look. I tucked the front of the jacket in and just... Um, bagged it over and it looked like a mini dress absolutely love that for me scrunch up my sleeves always and this look is everything i got the skirt in a size 8 a size 10 they didn't have any 10 but a size 10 would have been too big for me the 8 is just right like me need to stop me need to stop eat because if i gain a pound it's a wrap and I got the jacket in a size medium because it does fit oversize so another H&M look we talked earlier about the share trend so this is another take on the share trend like this dress it looks like nothing like a moo moo like 
I just need to wear this around the house but that's what happens when you just pick something up off the rack and the power of styling is always going to take a look to the next level okay it does have strings to tie in the front and it's definitely playing off of the uh, boho chic uh, trend that is going on right now and uh, the brand that does it and is doing it so well is Chloe but see I am in that tax bracket so I ran over to H&M okay love that it's long sleeve it is sheer it is line uh, however <laughs> as a real bad girl I removed the dress okay kept my bra on put my black tights on wrong move I should have put on my brown uh, I should have put on my brown tights instead of black so I, I'm happy that I know that so I don't wear that out added brown boots brown belt and my brown uh, Ralph Lauren tote bag because again big bags are trending so I'm happy that I still have that bag and it matched all the accessories because I love the brown and the blue together because this is like a ash blue I love the drop uh, waist and I like a frill detail at the end absolutely love it I got this in a size small I think this is sold out online but check your um, local H&M because that's the thing with these like H&M pieces they're sold out online but when you go in store they have so many of these pieces in store so FYI I'm still gonna leave the link and you can what you can do is plug the link in and it where it says find a store and once you it find a store it will give you the closest stores with the available sizes at that particular store so that's just the FYI okay another H&M look again I know these pieces are probably sold out but check your H&M because I shared these when I just got them I shared them in the community tab because I knew they would sell out real fast um, you know that I'm a suit gal like through and through like give me a suit every day of the week and I will wear it okay anywhere so I picked up this oversized blazer it's nice and heavy like me now have no business with this blazer like none at all because mega collapse but guess what at least i'm gonna be laying there looking fly okay so i picked this up in a size medium i checked i think they still have large extra large and double xl and it fits over and it runs big so that's just the fyi so it's double breasted absolutely love it like I said it's nice and heavy and then I picked up this uh, trousers in a size I think a size 10 yes a size 10 again I sized up for length and then I'm gonna get the waist um, altered and then I picked up this like tube vest looking top absolutely love it as well this was not available at first so I signed up for a restock notification and the moment it came in I went ahead and ordered it I got it in a size medium and so I'm pairing all three so first up the tube top with the pants because these actually go together these are matching uh, pieces and I opted to go for three belts yes I'm wearing three belts I am because when it comes to fall fashion it's all about styling it's all about styling it's all about details it's all about using your accessories as your power play so it's the time for you to play with your accessories so that you can get the maximum out of them use use your accessories whatever it is bags coats hats 
belts, shoes, jewelry, whatever it is, use it to take your outfits up a notch. So yes, I am wearing one, two, three belts. Okay? Cinch that waist. And I love it. I do. And then I just popped the blazer over my shoulders. I went for my black coach bag and um, I think some black slingback heels. I think those are from ASOS, but I'm going to return them because they are not comfortable to me at all so i'm happy that i didn't wear them out but i love the look so i now know that i i just need to find a replacement um for them but i absolutely love this together it's giving boss vibes and i love that for me and the final h and m look because <laughs> I know that y'all are gonna be tired of me saying um, it is so they're sold out online and I got this question I think the last um, clothing all that I shared why do I show pieces that are sold out one because others have the pieces and you can use my styling as inspiration Two, same thing you can use my styling as inspiration with similar pieces that you have in your closet so it doesn't necessarily have to be the exact same piece i know you might want or you want the exact same piece and i want you to get the exact same pieces but i have no control over inventory and so when i get it if i'm not sharing it right away then a lot of times it might get um, sold out before I am able to sit down and style it and do a video for you guys. And that's why most of the times when I find a piece, I will share it in the community tab. But that's without styling. That's just me taking off, taking it off the website to share it with you guys because I know that it's going to sell out. So to answer the question for the person who asks, inspiration, inspiration inspiration you don't have to have the same pieces use the video as reference for styling okay so i told you guys that i'm loving all black at the moment and so the la the h and m uh fall collection i picked up this black sheer top with uh sea queens uh detailing on on it I love it it's a it's just a simple button-down shirt but I love the sea queen detail on there and then I'm pairing it with this wide leg uh, pants also from that fall collection at H&M I got the pants in a size 10 and I got the shirt in a size medium and this is just a, a simple look but you can definitely wear this to an event the holidays are coming up sea queens glam glitz is a thing this shirt actually um had a matching skirt but i didn't want the skirt so i opted to pair it with this uh wide leg pants but this is great for the holidays i know we have like office parties your friends are keeping parties this is an outfit that you could definitely wear popped on my Alexander Wang pumps and uh, my little black black bag from the vault label just to complete the all black look. Such a classic. Never goes out of style. You'll always feel like that girl wearing black, okay? We are done with H&M. Let's get into some pieces that I picked up from Asus. I love to shop on Asus. Asus is a marketplace. They sell multiple brands. I even sign up for premier shipping because when I order, I want the things now. Like, I'm waiting at the mailbox. I want it today. So, this was actually a fashion week look, but it did not make the cut. But the holidays are coming up, and like I said, every time you see me this fall, I'm going to be dressed, okay? So, it is a skirt set, 
it is so heavy because of all the beads like look at all the beads oh my god and it's in this brown chocolate uh they're sold separate fyi so it's this uh cropped top with maxi skirt and i opted to go for just a nice balanced i would say uh look a good juxtaposition because this is giving glam but then i went ahead and added the brown western boots from h m you're seeing it on the cutaway at first i was like i'm just gonna do some brown strappy sandals but then i was like uh-uh that is a little bit too comfy you know so let us do something out of the box it's giving me i'm going to coachella but i'm not so western boots to play off of the brown and then i added the brown pixie market cropped leather jacket you're seeing it on the cutaway i love it i love it i cannot wait to wear this out i cannot i cannot wait to wear this out okay and it's crazy because that's not how i was gonna style it for fashion week so i'm happy i'm kind of happy that i didn't get to wear it because i prefer this styling compared to how i was gonna style it for fashion week so i'm happy for that i did my vault label brown bag just to complete a full-on like i said monochromatic brown look love 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 i got the top in a size uh, i got the top in a size eight so a us eight and I think I also got the skirt in a US 8. Yes, I got the skirt in a US 8 as well. I could definitely, definitely wear this with like a brown button-down shirt. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Then I can wear the strappy sandals with it. Mm-hmm. Next from Asos. You guys know this barrel jeans with the two-tone with the black at the back and the blue in the front so i picked up this sheer frail top it looks like nothing now but once i put it on you're gonna get the picture so uh this barrel jeans they also have it on asus so if it is something that you like i'll definitely link it for you if you've been around you know this because you know i'm a barrel jeans girl like give me all of them i'm not tired so i got this top in a size eight and it fits perfect it is completely sheer and then it has these like frilled um detail going down like all the way down absolutely love that this is um very artsy so love that this was also a fashion week look but it didn't make the cut so um this top also comes in i think pink and red so i'll definitely link um whatever is available uh for you guys for styling i popped on my zebra print attico shoes and my zebra print bag from amazon to complete the look I think when I'm wearing it out though, I am going to do like a red bag just for a nice pop of color. But for right now, love. Absolutely love. Uh, the jeans pants, just in case anybody is interested, I got it in a size medium. I could have done a large easily, but I bought this a while back. So now I need a large. But before... It was perfectly fine. Like, somebody come and move my kitchen, please. Because the girl's been cooking. And obviously eating. Okay? Alright, so we have a dress moment. 
uh, this dress I picked up from Dillard's. Now, this dress was one of the options for the LTK Con Awards, but I opted to go with the red dress instead. If you guys watched the LTK Con vlog, if you didn't, go back and watch it. But I love this pink dress. It was on sale and I was like, I'm not going to leave it. I can definitely wear this to a party during the, um, the holidays. And I could wear this to a wedding during the springtime. It is something that definitely has its place in my closet. It's this hot pink. I don't mind. I love colors. It, is this, it has this asymmetrical cut. So short on one side and super long on the other side. Love that. I picked this up. It's actually an extra large. Actually an extra large. So, <laughs> it was on super sale though. Picked it up at Dillard's. It was originally $139 and I got it for $48.65. So, run. It is so good. It is from the brand um, Bardot. The same brand as the red dress. So you know. It's good. I opted to style it with gold. Because I'm thinking dressy. I'm thinking um, a event. A wedding. You can just. Right now you could probably pop a coat on over it. And once you get inside you can take it off. But this is such a great... We have two more looks and then... No, three. Oh, but I didn't do a cutaway for this. I'm still going to show it. I've shown this in the community tab. Follow me on Instagram at Carrie Spence underscore. Because I even shared this in the community tab with a discount code. It's ended now. But this set is from... Um, Adidas and it is long wide leg love I got it in a size medium and I picked up the shirt to match like I care nothing about Labor Day and oh we're not supposed to wear white I'm gonna wear whatever I want whenever I want but this set also comes in black and it also comes in lilac so I'll definitely link all three in the description box for you. If you don't want the cropped shirt, you could definitely do the long sleeve sweatshirt. They also have it in that as well to match the pants. But this is such a great set. Definitely wearing this with sneakers. So I cannot wait to wear this out. I'll try to pop up a picture or video on the side because I think I did um, share it in stories when it came in. So I'll pop up that picture and video on the side just so that you can see how um, it fit. But the fit is perfection, okay? And FYI, I am 5 feet 7. So that should give you an idea of like where it falls once you see the cutaway. Next up, this super wide leg pants with this uh, big pleat in the front. It is from the brand uh, Naked Wardrobe. It is from their new fall collection. I got it in a size medium and it fits perfect. I love the contrasting uh, waistband. And I love the way the waistband is um, sitting. So it's like a crisscross with like a V uh, cut in the middle. And this is how it looks like super wide leg and long. So this is tall girl friendly, of course. Because even with eels, it is still dragging on the floor. So I opted to go with just like a cropped knit like sweater looking top super old from macy's um my zebra print shoes zebra print bag and i think i popped on my red like moto cropped uh, jacket I, I i don't remember where that jacket is from right now but if it is still available i'll definitely link it for you but i love this 
originally I wanted to style this with like a bustier top I have like a black bustier top from Lioness and I left it at my sister's house that's why you know for what boat you know that's why you know for what boat so I had to improvise but I think moving forward that's how I'm gonna style it with the uh, corset top because I, I see it in my head and I like how it looks let me know if that's if you do that as well have you ever thought about an outfit like you put it together in your head and sometimes it works out when you actually get the pieces and sometimes they don't and you're really disappointed let me know the final look we're down to the final look if you made it to the final look let me know in the comments if you made it to the final look you are a G okay I'm a retail <laughs> so final look I put this look again I put this look in my head and I found the pieces and I'm happy with the outcome so a slip skirt and this like super light like light airy pink maxi like long again i'm five seven so you know and you see it's hitting the ground and another suede jacket in brown but in a different brown because see this one is more of a, a camel meanwhile this is like deep dark brown the only thing i don't like with this like the shoulder pad is very light so i'm definitely gonna add like my big shoulder pads to it and for styling i'm pairing this look with because i'm going for like a western theme vibe yeah like western chic mm-hmm so and I'm playing with the textures of the satin and the uh, suede. Love the combination. So I added this uh, bolo uh, necklace. Like I got it from Amazon. And it's the right color. It matches the skirt. Oh, everything. I belted the waist because I didn't like how the blazer fall because it doesn't have like a, a cinched waist. So I belted the waist to cinch the waist, pop on my dark brown western boots from H&M and my little black bag because I'm mixing the browns with the black and I love. You're seeing it on the cutaway. I cannot wait to take her outside okay absolutely love I got the skirt in a size large again I sized up I had to I have no choice the medium would have fit if you don't get your right size in a slip skirt it's gonna look like bundled up and it's not gonna fit right okay so make sure that you get your right size I got the blazer also in a size large because I love oversized blazers, okay? And I love the fit of this. I love this look. It came out how I envisioned it, envisioned it. All I need to do is add shoulder pads to it. So that's the last look. Let me know what are your thoughts. And just like that, we've come to the end of another video. Thank you guys so, so much for watching and sticking to the end. If you've come this far and you have not subscribed, like, girl, what are you waiting for? Go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you never miss a post. Links to everything will be in the description box. Make sure that you're following me on the LTK app. All of these pieces that are I'm able to link I've already been linked in LTK. If you follow me over there, you would have seen it. Follow me on Instagram. I am Carrie Spence. So Carrie Spence underscore everywhere. Instagram, TikTok, Pinterest, Facebook. Search for me. Follow me. 
come and join the community i hope that you guys enjoyed this video i know it was long it was super long but only because i've been away for so long and i wanted to make it up to you guys so i hope i did <laughs> and you guys can forgive me now i'm back and back and back and i'm gonna be coming so make sure that y'all are ready okay thank you always for watching and keeping me lifted in your prayers i appreciate you guys more than you ever know i will catch you in another video but until then be good Mwah.